Good evening. This is Tina. How are you doing today? Um, my last video about uh, is an exercise about all the aggregations. And uh, there are lots of other aggregation stages we haven't talked about. And I think uh, the main reason is I don't have time. And also, if you can do some of them, you can. It's easier for you to learn others. You just look at the official document, and they have a very detailed instructions or information about each of the stage. And now, what I'm trying to do is, I want to do is to give instruction on the indexes. So, what is the index? Okay. Suppose now. Okay, let, let's uh, give you concrete example. Okay, let's give add a new page, which is index. Okay. Indexes. So but now in our database, we have the, uh, we have the documents about the, how about the students? Okay. Um, students, okay. Oh, great. Okay, for for this class, suppose for this class, uh, for the the uh, the course like called uh, let's call the uh, Node JS this course, okay, and each student gonna have a grade or have a score, right? Uh, I will do is, uh, uh, what's the student ID is one and the name of uh, name, okay, name is someone, uh, Josh, okay. And then he got the grade score is uh, eighty. Okay, and then uh, this is the this is a collection. Okay, this is a collection. Let's call course. Okay, and then we have another ID is two. Name is Emma. Make sure it's a double quote. Okay, Emma, and the score is ninety. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, I should put this on first, so we don't waste a lot of time on these things. This one, candy uh, score is eighty-eight, and we have another one, ID, uh, which is uh, uh, we have we have some remaining. Okay, and we have a last one, ID is one hundred. Okay, name. Yes, candy, uh, curry, steam, uh, okay, uh, lily. <laughs> this is uh, the popular name, uh, popular name used uh, when I started learning Chinese English in China. And uh, this is the common name in the book, in a textbook. It, we are using Tom, Lily, Lucy. <laughs> And another probably Sam or Tom or some anyway Lily Lucy are the name for the ladies for the girls okay for the female. So now this is my collection course. I have those documents inside that. Now I want to find a particular person. I want to find the students which their score is equals uh, like uh, eighty. So how the uh, I want to find like a db dot course okay your dot find and uh, I want I want to find when the score I want to find all student that score is uh, eighty five okay how the MongoDB perform this query to perform this query because. We don't. We just create a collection. We don't do anything special. Then MongoDB will do. Yes, he will scan each of the document inside uh, this collection. Each of them, from the beginning to the end, and until if it find it return. If it doesn't find, it doesn't return. Each of them, which is uh, really, really not efficient. Think about it. If you have one thousand or one million, you're gonna scan for one million documents to in order to get a result for you. So for this query, this uh, not efficient, right? And uh, another way we can do is uh, we can add index to boost the query performance. Okay, to make our query faster. 
okay and index can support for that how to do that we can do is like this db dot course dot uh, create index okay and then in the index you just give a field and uh, you can give it's a des ascending order or it's a descending order so what if I do this one what it does do index can store some a uh, single field value in your document like here if I do in this one in our index it's gonna be like this okay like this this part is gonna be our index okay let me using another color this is our index okay and those this part is our uh, documents so what I'm gonna do a uh, score when you add a score one okay which means in the index it's gonna store the value for score okay and then this one is using from uh, the left to right it's gonna using ascending ascending order okay so here suppose the lowest is 60 it's gonna be like a 60 61 based on the values of the score and eventually you have 22 like a 80 like a 88 like a 90 like this so if now if i want to store uh search for the score 85 i don't need to search the entire documents you know i don't need to search i can search based on the index okay i can search from here from minimum uh, from the maximum to the 85 i only search portion of the documents not all the documents that's how index to um, support or boost the query performance in mongodb and uh, this is a single value okay got, got an idea got an idea and uh, uh, for if you want to using a, a descending order you, you just using score and the minus one and the how to uh, it's gonna do is here we'll have an index here okay index okay and that's gonna be using the highest score and the, to be the lower lowest score okay and but it doesn't matter if we want to find if we do a find doesn't matter it's ascending or descending because mongodb can search from the left and also can start from the right and that's the point of index okay first index is used for what index is used for uh, support the query in mongodb it can make our query faster because without the index mongodb for the query needed to do a collection scan which means a scan for all the values in our collection but after index because it will store one your specific field uh, value like this way or you can also create an index like uh, I also can create an index which is a compound key like uh, I have a name equals ascending and I have a score descending you can also have this way okay which then can span a set of values but not your entire documents just uh, some fields arrow uh, some fields value inside uh, your document like the, the example score I give to you and then if now uh, when I do a query it will based on your index to do the query so it can start from minimum one it can start from the maximum one and if it is smart it can start from the middle which is like a half half to do like that way okay so uh, index can uh, with the index it doesn't do it does with the index it does not need to do a collection scan it just scan part of your collection okay either from minimum either from maximum like this way so this is how index help to uh, pro uh, provide a better performance on queries okay i hope after this uh, like a scenario or example you understand how index help on increase um, query performance 
in the database. And the MongoDB's uh, index is a similar to other SQL database index. Same idea, okay? So uh, in next few videos, I'm gonna talk about like uh, the what's 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 thing. I'm gonna talk about like a single field index, like a compound index, which is the index contains more than one field, and uh, it will also has the unique index and also the sparse index, and others. Okay. Uh, anyway. Uh, if you want to learn more about index and uh, watch my other videos, okay. Uh, thank you for watching this video. See you next time. Bye-bye.